Hey guys, welcome to my first ever video. Today I'm going to teach you how to mask and put two celebrities together. So first of all, click on your first clip and go to effects bar and type in motion tile and drag it across your clip. Make the width about 200 or 300, then click on P for position and drag your clip across. After you've done that, I would like you to click on mirrors, which will give you more space to add the other celebrity. As you can see, my second clip is Ariana Grande. The second clip has to be appropriate to the first clip. As you can see, she's facing the interviewer and he's facing her. Now double click on your second clip and click on the Roto Brush tool. It should be this green kind of paintbrush which should go over your clip and it should turn purple on the bits you want to keep. And let's just say accidentally you click on the wrong thing. Just click on Alt on your keyboard and go over the bit that you don't want. If you're having trouble with the brush size, all you need to do is click on Control and your left mouse key at the same time and just swipe up and down on your mouse. If you want to see your mask, click on the toggle alpha boundary and then change the smooth feather and choke. This will allow your clip to look a bit more smoother and neat because if you don't do that, it will look really bumpy. And if you want your mask to go throughout your whole clip, if you see the yellow square, just drag it across and make sure it looks dark grey. Play to check your mask if it's fine. Sometimes the background will come in which you need to remove so it's best if you check your whole clip to see if you've masked correctly. So now I've clipped to my composition and as you can see Ariana Grande is a bit bigger than Tom Holland. So what I need to do is adjust my first clip and make sure it's the same size. To make sure the clips are matching type in brightness and contrast into effects and presets bar and drag it onto one clip. Doesn't matter which one you start with. And now make sure your contrast is high and how you like it. And then do the same for the second clip and this time make sure it matches the first clip as you can see I'm doing here. Ariana's hair looks like it's missing so I'm just going to fix that by double clicking and going back to the Roto brush tool and making sure that her hair is there. So as you can see I am now done and it looks realistic and looks like they're together so please try it out with any celebrity you want.